recording, Kathy? We are now. All right. Hey, everybody. Welcome, welcome. It's Monday night. I always feel like I'm hosting Saturday Night Live, like it's Saturday Night Live. Well, it's Monday Night Live. And uh, I'm so glad to see so many of you popping on tonight. Uh, this is a special night. Uh, I'm Terry Luongo, by the way. I'm a presidential marketing director for the Juice Plus Company. And uh, I have been with this amazing company for 28 years. I'll be celebrating my 28th anniversary next month. And I have been swallowing Juice Plus without missing a day for 28 years. And uh, tonight is special because tonight is an extension of what we do. We're always talking health and wellness when it comes to our fruits, vegetables, and berry blend. Well, tonight we're gonna to be talking about our amazing omegas. And uh, this is a conversation I've wanted to have for a long time because I absolutely, as much as I love my fruits, vegetables, and berries, I can't imagine my life without my omegas. And, you know, this company is just amazing. We always, you know, we always meet the need. We knew that there was a need for fruits, vegetables, and berries. People were not complying with the amount of produce that they needed to eat. They couldn't or they wouldn't. And so, you know, this company found a way to grow it, produce it, juice it, dry it, and not lose the nutrition. And it's the same thing with the omegas. We realized that there was a need for a vegan Omega formulation. So we rose up and our scientists went to work and they have developed what I think is just state of the art Omega nutrition. But you don't wanna hear about this from me. So tonight I asked, uh, I kind of consider uh, our next speaker, our resident uh, physician, uh, Dr. Joan Hunter from Portland, Oregon, uh, who just recently uh, got her certification as a lifestyle physician. And I think she might tell us a little bit about that, I hope. And, and she's also an amazing chef. You can, she televises her, her cooking program. So she's a teacher. Uh, she's a physician. She's brilliant. But I wanted to talk to Dr. Joan very specifically tonight about right here. Here's my cat, heart health, February. It's about heart health, uh, about the omegas, but also it's not just heart health. It's how the omegas affect every single cell, tissue, organ, and system in the body. So Dr. Joan, are you with me? I'm here, Terry. Thank you. Okay. Well, thanks for being with us. And thank you for, you know, always rising up and sharing your wisdom and your knowledge with us. So tonight, very specifically the omegas, you know, Dr. Hunter, why do physicians recommend omegas to almost every single one of their patients. What, what is the, re the reason for that? Well, you know, thank you for asking me on the call tonight. I always learn quite a bit when I'm asked to speak. So I had to do some of my own research, but I think one of the most important reasons why we recommend omegas is because they're essential fatty acids for our bodies and we as humans cannot produce them. So if you're not getting it through your diet, you're not getting it. And, um, you know, specifically, we hear a lot about omega-3 and the health benefits of omega-3. There are actually 11 different types of omega-3 fatty acids. And the three most common are the EPA, the DHA, and the ALA, uh, all of which are in the Juice Plus Omega product. And the EPA um, fatty acid is, I learned this on a lifestyle medicine board test, can only be found in algae. So the, you know, we eat it most commonly through fish source, but the fish get it from the algae. And it's actually probably a um, microbiome interaction with the algae that creates the EPA. So um, that's a really special way that Juice Plus found to put EPA in a capsule is going straight through the algae itself and bypassing the fish product, which is really nice for a lot of us. Um, okay, so we bypassed the fish and we went straight to the algae. But what, you know, a lot of what I've learned about omegas, I know I've learned through the Juice Plus community. And we have like this full spectrum, the three, the five, the six, the seven, the nine. Uh, super impressed with that. You know, how, what are your feelings on this broad spectrum omega? Yeah, again, I was doing some more reading and it, all of these different omegas are really important and they come from different parts of the plant family. Uh, 
And it's really important to have them in the right ratios. So you may have heard of omega-6 as being a pro-inflammatory omega, and that's if you don't consume it in the right ratios. And the, realize what, the reason why most Americans are consuming too much omega-6 is that we're eating fried foods and we're eating foods that are fried in vegetable oil and vegetable oil and seeds is where we find a lot of omega-6. So in those really processed baked goods and in fried foods, you're gonna be getting over you know, 10 times the amount of omega-6 you need and you're not getting enough of omega-3. So the really nice thing about the blend with um, Juice Plus has put out is that it's in the correct proportions of omega-3 to six to nine. So it should be about a two to one to one ratio. And I went and looked at the bottle when I saw that ratio and yeah, we're right in line with that. And so you're gonna be not only getting your omegas from a really healthy plant source, um, but also getting them in the right ratios in the way your body needs it. And again, with our omega-3, we have all three of those most common and most important omega-3s, the EPA, the DHA, and the ALA. And as you can see, we're gonna get more of the EPA and more of the DHA, and those are really the most important ones to get. That is, it's just, um, you know, love the research that was done behind developing our omega. All right, so um, we hear a lot about omegas in heart health. We hear a lot about the need for healthy omegas for the brain, for emotions, you know, um, even to help with anxiety and depression. Can you expand on that a little bit, Dr. Hunter? Yeah, Terry, I found this really, really interesting as I was looking through this. There's, um, you know, hundreds of studies have been done on looking at omega and its impact on the body. And really you can look through almost every organ system and see some positive impact from omega. So if you want to, uh, depression was actually the number one topic that came up in my research recently. And there was a study that blew me away that daily supplementation with an EPA omega-3 fatty acid was as effective as a starting dose of an antidepressant medication for the treatment of depression. And this was in a randomized trial where they were collecting, you know, before and after depression scores. And actually the depression medicine improved by 50%, the EPA improved by 56%. So, um, you know, this is a really impressive study to me. So uh, somebody asked me to repeat that. So a daily serving of the EPA omega-3 fatty acid was as effective as the starting dose of an antidepressant medication in treating depression and reducing depression scores by 50%. So I, I was blown away by that. That was an amazing finding to me. Wow. But it makes sense because what these omegas do in our body and they have lots of different factors, but omegas are really important in our cell membranes. Your brain is actually almost 10% DHA, omega-3. Um, so if you don't have the omegas, your cells are really crying out for help. There's a lot of inflammation, they're not functioning well. So pretty much everything that I looked at really pointed back to the way they decrease inflammation, the way they support the immune system, the way they support brain cell health, you know, um, DHA is really important in eye health. DHA in pregnancy is really important in fetal brain development. So, you know, the, the prenatal vitamins folks have gotten wise. You pretty much can't get a prenatal vitamin without DHA any, anymore, but they're showing lower rates of autism and ADHD in children whose mothers took uh, DHA omega fatty acids during pregnancy. So it's really important when you're thinking about all the building blocks of the cells going together that you're having these healthy cell membranes, these healthy brain cells. Um, we, we definitely have heard about it in heart health. We know that omega-3 supplementation reduces triglyceride levels, which is basically just fat that's circulating in our blood. Uh, it helps to lower blood pressure, helps to raise good cholesterol, but I think a lot of what they do is really decrease inflammation. You know, we talk about this all the time that inflammation is the base of pretty much all chronic diseases. So if we can help reduce that inflammatory response, even out the immune system response. So um, not only is our omega-3 fatty acids helpful in supporting the immune system, and that's actually something that the omega-5 does as well, that it has some antioxidant effects and omega-7 um, it has some positive immune effects. So again, we're getting that whole wide variety, that balanced blend. Um, but you know, some of them not only support the immune system, but also help calm it down. So decreased autoimmune 
disorders um, with omega supplementation and actually using omega-3 supplementation to treat things like Crohn's disease and um, some of these other autoimmune diseases that we're seeing so often. You know what I love, Joan? I love how it's the perfect, it's just the per perfect you know, side product to our fruits, vegetables, and berry formulation. Uh, I love how all four work together. And I know that for myself, you know, specifically, you know, about four years ago, I had uh, a major concussion. Many of you that are on the call tonight know that. And, um, you know, I had been speaking to a very, very, very well-known, world-renowned uh, doctor who told me, uh, you know, Terry, you really, really, really need to intensify uh, your intake of omegas. And he was very much impressed with our omega blend. And I did. And I know that over time, uh, it had a major effect uh, on the symptoms that I was experiencing with my concussion. So uh, Dr. Hunter, did you know that we have an amazing piece of research on our omegas? I did, and I'm very impressed by this as well. So I'm eager for everyone on the call to hear the information you're gonna share about that later. So that's um, what we're gonna do now. I think okay. we're gonna deviate over there. And then I'm gonna want your take uh, on the research. So guys, what you need to know going into this is that we have 41 pieces of peer reviewed published research on our Juice Plus. And uh, this is our first piece of research on our Omegas. So I am super excited to share this with you. It's a, a recording, it's about four minutes long. So sit back and enjoy this. And then later we'll tell you where you can find this if you wanna view this, uh, this uh, piece of research yourself. So Kathy, whenever you're ready. Independent investigators at leading universities have studied Juice Plus fruit and vegetable capsules since 1995, resulting in 40 peer-reviewed papers published in leading scientific journals. Recently, the International Journal of Food Sciences and Nutrition published peer-reviewed paper number 41, this time on the results of a clinical study of Juice Plus Omega Plant capsules by researchers at the Medical University of Graz in Austria. Juice Plus Omega Plant is an omega fatty acid supplement with two important differences from most omega-3 fatty acid products. First, it is a multiple omega supplement containing five different omega fatty acids, omega-3, 5, 6, 7 and 9. Second, it is 100% plant-based. Unlike most other omega-3 products, the omega-3s in Juice Plus Omega Plant are sourced not from fish, but from the algae the fish feed on. The Graz researchers wanted to know whether plant-based Juice Plus Omega Plant could increase study participants' omega-3 index. The omega-3 index is a measure of the bioavailability of the specific omega-3 fatty acids named DHA and EPA based on their concentrations in red blood cells. DHA and EPA must be supplied either through our diet or by taking omega-3 supplements since the body is not able to create them by itself. One of the main reasons the omega-3 index is so important is that there is strong scientific evidence that DHA and EPA contribute to normal function of the heart, while DHA contributes to the maintenance of normal brain function and the maintenance of normal vision. The Graz Omega study was a controlled, randomized clinical trial in which researchers analyzed 68 healthy subjects. All participants kept their usual diets and lifestyles for the 16 weeks of the trial. The only change was the supplements consumed during this time. The omega-3 index for each participant was checked at baseline, the midway point of the study after week 8 and at the end of the study after week 16. So what did the researchers discover? 
that two capsules a day of Choose Plus Omega Plant over 8 weeks increase the omega-3 index significantly and that after 16 weeks the index increased even more. Wow. So Dr. Hunter, does that also speak to the bioavailability bio of our omegas? What's your thoughts Absolutely. on that? Yeah, I think um, it definitely shows that it's bioavailable. If you can measure it in the cell membrane of your red blood cell, that omega is getting in there and it's being put to use by your body. And I think that's a really important point, Terry, because you know, you might see on the label that maybe there's not as much EPA or DHA as there is in some other fish-based products, but that's showing you that the quality of this omega fatty acid and the bioavailability of it is very high. So this is, all of this is getting into your system and being put to use. That's an important point to make. That is so fascinating. So do you have any uh, closing thoughts before we change the format a little bit tonight? You know, this is a product my family's consuming. My kids crunch the capsules and swallow the, the oil and love it. My daughter, you know, gets as many as I do every day. And, uh, you know, we've just seen really positive changes in our family and it's supported by everything that we know that omega fatty acids do in your body. So hair, skin, and nails looking great. That's there in the, in the research and, you know, the, my kids' immune system, functioning well and them doing well with their development. So it's really priceless when you see that in your children. Oh, isn't it wonderful? And I love an aspect of this that I, I encounter and hear over and over and over again uh, from um, people who are taking the omegas is how well they sleep at night. Mm. And yeah, that, uh, I, I don't know why that happens, Dr. Hunter, but I'm hearing that over and over again. Well, the DHA actually directly impacts melatonin secretion. So I ran into that in my research for this talk. All right. So now I know. Now I know. <laughs> not just a coincidence. Not, not a coincidence. All right. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to stop our streaming into Transform 2021. And so if you were watching us on our Facebook page, thank you. And you can uh, always go back and you can listen to that. Uh, but right now, what we're going to do live in the chat room is uh, we have some people that are going to share their very 